Rose Island with AEW Main Treasure Adventures. Today, we're back over at Echo Lake. We're gonna dive back in and pull out anything that shouldn't be here. Our first find of the day, a piece of bandage. I had a terrible time trying to locate this target. A small metal piece. I'm not sure what it went to. Finally, a good find today. We got a 14 karat gold whale pendant. This is Fred Flintstone Bass. Flintstone is his middle name, no relation to the cartoon. And here comes his wife, Wilma Bass. One of the smallest finds of the day, an earring back. Here is about a hundred of our fish friends. They followed me every day I was at Echo Lake. Rusty, rusty nail right on the surface of the swimming area. Don't want anybody to step on this. We had a ton of different species come and see what I was doing from trout, bass, bullheads, white sucker fish, pickerel, perch, and sunfish. I spent a lot of time swimming around with them. We got a little coin on the day. Here is a quarter. Tin foil. Here's a hair tie, a band-aid. I also spent a lot of time walking around and picking up anything that I could see. Of course, there is more. I don't know if there's a band-aid heaven, but if there is, I think it would look something like this. piece of bandage. A huge school of trout. They love to watch me from a distance. They were usually around 15 feet away and would do circles around me for hours on end. It was pretty cool. Oh, what is that? 
I can't believe this ended up about 150 to 200 yards from the beach. It's a sandcastle mold. This was a piece of a hearing aid. A bandana. Groovy, man. A wrapper. This is the stuff that bugs me the most. Another wrapper. People, all you gotta do is throw it away. This shouldn't be that difficult. Multiple trash cans from the beach to your car. Some more gross band-aids. But I don't care. I take everything that doesn't belong in the water. My number one goal isn't finding treasure. It's cleaning out the waterways and making the swimming areas a little safer. Any treasure I find is a bonus. I've also been able to reunite some people with their lost items, which always feels good to do. I found some old swimming rope tie downs. Acadia National Park, if you would like me to mark these or take them out for you, let me know. I have all their locations electronically marked. I'm just walking around the bottom of the lake, checking out the fish and looking for any more trash. Here's a rubber strap. I had been using my pinpointer all day, so the battery started to run out. I got through the day, though. We got a pendant. Cool. That's like part of the pendant. Ah. Hopefully you can see that. A fancy bobby pin. Okay, nothing fancy about it. Water metal detecting day is complete until you find some bobby pins. We got a quarter of a ring. A ring is a ring, I guess. It's a piece of a ring. <laughs> this is jewelry. I don't know what it went to. Two leaves connected. Here, I'm searching for more targets. We got a ring, this time a whole ring. 
with a heart on it. Yeah, it's got a ring, but it's, it's like a cheap either toe ring or... Next target, we got an earring. Alright, we got an earring. Um, Hello everyone, this is Adam with AEW Main Treasure Adventures. We just got out of Echo Lake, diving in the deep end. We found some weird stuff. This huge piece of rubber, a bunch of cloth, a kid's sand castle, which must have floated out in the deep end before it sank, tons of band-aids. I guess that's where all the band-aids go to die. A bunch of bobby pins, which I'm a little surprised, some hair ties, wrappers, tons of tin foil. A battery, an earpiece. That's the weirdest thing that I found. The worst thing I found was a cigarette filter. All the toxins from the cig cigarette leach into the water. For coins, we got two nickels, a quarter, and two dimes. And then for treasure, we actually got a couple little nice little things. We got a cheap earring. I don't know what this is, but it's kind of cool. A couple of leaves. Uh, part of a pendant, or a pendant, I guess. Piece of a ring. An earring back. An earring. Uh, there might be stamp on there. But anyway, this one is stamped. This is 14 karat gold. It's a little pendant. It's kind of cool. And it's a whale. That's definitely the best treasure of the day. Anyway, we got it a little cleaner. Let's go see Fred and Wilma again. Oh, buddy! Hi! Thank you, Cynthia, for not only joining the Level 2 or Higher Membership Program, but also naming our best friend, Fred, in today's adventure. Any membership level, 2 or higher, can name one of our animal friends in an upcoming adventure. If you would like to become a member, click the Join button on YouTube and let me know in the live chat or send me an email with your name and what main animal you would like to name. I appreciate the support, and until the next video, AEW out.